Hello guys, my name is Shadelia and welcome back for another episode of our Parcel 2 playthrough. And we are continuing where we left off last time. I think we're trying to get back inside the facility. Yeah, I have a bad feeling about the water down here. As well as many other things, to be honest. Okay, there's something dropping there. Right, so this is wall we can put a puzzle in. Is there something over there? Uh, there might be. Let's have a look at this way though first. I'm assuming that does not open. And this is very dark, so I don't think we need to go this way. So I'm assuming we need to go through that door then. Unless we can get up there. Well, let's first check if we can get inside here or not. We can. I don't know where this takes, but... Okay. Welcome, gentlemen, to Amateur Science. Astronauts, war heroes, Olympians, you're here because we want the best. And you are it. So, who's ready to make some science? I am. <laughs> now, you already met one another on the limo ride over, so let me yeah, introduce okay, myself. Put... No. I am Cave Johnson. I own the place. That eager voice you heard is the lovely Carolyn, my assistant. Rest assured, she has transferred your honorarium to the charitable organization of your choice. Isn't that right, Carolyn? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. She's the backbone of this facility. Bring us a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas. She's married. Science. Okay then. Okay, so I can't get anything up there. Can I get a portal somewhere on that ledge then? Uh, I don't think I can. Unless uh, over there? No. Well then. Oh, there's something up there that I could probably use. Let's put it down there. Okay, here we are. I wonder why I need to go from here. Up or down? I guess we could go this way. Uh, maybe. Oh god. Thank god we have these boots. Okay then. Uh, okay, so it's not gonna let me in from... Well, in there. I don't think so. We need to figure out our next plan. What to try. I mean, quite frankly... Is there... We could jump on this pipe here. Almost. Almost. First of all, we should probe put you a bit lower. Quite, well, we can still use this one. So, I'm assuming it's a pipe we need to get on. Okay, we are here. So, is this pipe next? Okay. Is it down there, or is that way too low again? All we could do is try to jump down that ledge. Yep, that works. I'm assuming this is where we need to go, but I honestly have no idea. Maybe not. Okay then, is there a way for us to get over there, even from here? 
not really. What I could do is... Okay, we can't get past the pipe there. That's the only other door I can see here, unless I'm in the wrong place anyway, that's uh, entirely possible. Do I get there? I mean, technically, if I can get high enough drop, I could catapult myself from that ledge there. That might work, just might. But we need to get enough speed for it to actually work, so we need to get over here. Then we put that thing over there, and that thing down here, and here we go. Ah, there we go. There's a thousand tests performed every day here in our enriched hemispheres. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. Well then. Your test assignment will vary depending on the manner in which you have bent the world to your will. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. Okay, Those so of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you, fighting an army of mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. Okay then. Right, uh, is there... Okay, there's that wall and there's that wall, so I'm assuming this is where we need to go. Oh. Uh, a little bit to the left. There we go. If you've cut yourself at all in the course of these tests, you might have noticed that your blood is pure. Just a heads up, we're going to have a superconductor turned up full blast and pointed at you for the duration of this next test. I'll be if you need to go to the bathroom after this next series of tests, please let a test associate okay, know. So we can't get because in all likelihood, these, whatever comes out thinking. of you is going to be cold. Only temporary, so do not worry. If it persists for a week, though, start worrying and come see us because that's not supposed to happen. Now, where the hell do I need to go? If you've cut yourself at all in the course of these tests, you might have noticed that your blood is pure gasoline. That's normal. We've been shooting you with an invisible laser that's supposed to turn blood into gasoline, so all that means is it's working. Okay, where can we put that portal down? I can't really see where we need to go. Okay, I mean, that's probably why I advise you to use a zoom. Yeah, that's not working. And that's not gonna work. Okay, let's get back into the central path so we might see a little bit better. I mean, I know that one is there. Wait a minute. Is it using the same thing again? I mean, is there a way for us to... Down there is that. And I'm assuming that is where we need to go. That or that. I don't know for sure which one. But obviously there is that ledge where we can catapult ourselves somewhere over that area. I don't know where it would hit us. But we need to find a surface where we can put the portal on and jump down to it quite frankly I don't like this place to be honest but there's probably quite a few 
know what? Can we... Okay, we can't jump that. We can walk down a little bit. I mean, quite frankly, what I'm thinking is, is there something on the bottom of the lift where we could put our portal? And jump on that. Uh, I'd say maybe, but... Okay, let's try the lift again. Okay, that's not... Okay. That's not working. Let's uh, walk a little bit down. I'm not going to walk the whole way. Aha. Uh -huh. I knew it. Okay, so let's put the blue one over there. Put the orange one over there and jump down. That was perfect. Okay, I guess this way. Know your allergies. Antimatter? Oh, okay. <laughs> Well, there's a door here, and well, obviously we're going to have to use that wall for something. Okay, um, I can see there's a ledge up there. Can we put... Oh, it doesn't... Yeah, that would work, but that's not quite what we are looking for. Um, okay, let's have a look. We put one down here. Can we... Yes, we can. Now, where is this going to take us? Apparently not... Well, I don't know. Probably not where we're looking for, but... Okay, we can't use that one either. Well, there's that one, of course. Is there... Wait, that's the way we came in, of course. So these doors are not working. Right. Um... I guess we do need to go up there somehow. Or back up there. So is there a way we could see from here? Can we walk up this? No, not quite. And what's down here? We'll get back. Hold on. It's another lift. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. I'm assuming this is going to take my... Yeah. Portals off. Well, at least we are going onwards in this game. So that's something. And I have to say, I like a lot these puzzles. Oh god, that's bright light. Alright, let's get started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or okay, so, so we are there, and... I'm guessing we need to go up all the way. Right. Remember. This test is unresolvable without an aperture size possible quantum tunneling device. Oh. Ok. 
Okay, so if we jump down there, it jumps. Okay. Interesting. Now there's uh, there's something up there. Oh. Is there something we could get on top of this? Any items down there? Okay, there's... Uh... Oh. Okay, I get it. There we go. Now we put that. We run in here. Okay, so we got that and just jump over here. The lab boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded <laughs> messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. I pay the bills here. I can talk about the control group okay, all Okay, so where do we need to go now? Because there's something up there. And that's where we came from. Okay. Okay, we can't puzzle. Oh. Okay. What's next? I'm guessing this is the... Well, I don't know. It could be a right way. Or it could be a wrong way. Uh, let's have a look at what's down this way, though. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, this seems to lead nowhere. So I am guessing it's the other way. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. Oh, so it's a uh, temporary jump boost, I'm guessing. Or not. Okay, oh, okay, so there's that. Well, we need to put something on, but is there a way for us to get items down here? Uh, oh, there's that one. Here we are. Right, so if we go this way and jump here. And let's put you down there and the blue one that way. Yeah, it's back to basics mostly. So we got that one, now we need to get up there. Now is there a way for us to... What's that? I don't know. Okay, so we need to get... That's not going to work. Hold on. There's that one. And if there's something... We could use the bouncing. We'll bounce ourselves to something. I mean, we could try to jump here, but... I don't know. That's yeah, not going to work that. <laughs> I'm an idiot. So we got this far. And there's that. Uh, still.
Oh god. Well, that worked. What does that do, actually? That's just uh, part of this one. Ah, there's the exit there. Oh. Right. So we need to put that there, and we need to get some extra speed somehow. On the other hand... No, no, really. I mean, if we do it this way... Yep, that works. Oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one, and it does not... Well, that's good to know. Skeleton. Well, it seems that we have once again reached the end of this episode, so if you liked it, uh, please leave a like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. All these science spheres are made of asbestos, and, by the way. Uh, check out my Patreon Discord links down below. But other than that, thank you very much for watching and until next time, bye bye.